a small but powerful furnace. I have a month with him and I love it. I use nail polish on the buttons and the letters are not discolored when cleaning. Great toaster and convection oven works well, although the on-off button ink has already worn off to my disappointment. Great second oven for pizzas where you don't need to heat up the larger oven, and wait for it. Perfect for our family of four, easy to use and pretty accurate in temp as far as I can tell. The only complaint I have is that the lettering on the buttons run off easily, see picture. I have been using my new convection oven, toaster almost every day. I live alone and most often have no need of using my big oven anymore. I can heat up some fish and chips in just a few minutes, make a quick bread or pan of brownies, etc. It fits on my countertop without taking up a lot of space. It's easy to clean and so far I have not had any issue with the labels on the buttons fading, which some others have mentioned in their reviews. The oven arrived yesterday and I've used it four times so far, twice for toast, once of pizza, and once for phyllo dough and brie pastries. As others have stated, the build quality is far from rugged. The exterior is made of thin metal and the pan that comes with it warps slightly when it gets hot. The exterior metal makes a small pop as it expands when it heats up and again when it cools down. That may go away over time though. There's a small bump out on the back of the oven. I'm sure it's there to increase interior space but it gets very hot, I have the burn to prove it. Be sure the back of the oven has a few inches clearance from a backsplash or wall. And be sure the plug doesn't come in contact with it. The top of the oven gets warm but if you have adequate space between the top of the oven and any cabinets that are above it, you should be fine. The oven is more compact than I thought. We have limited counter space so I went with the smaller model although I think the larger model would have fit and would have provided some advantages, more on that later. The controls are relatively straightforward although you'll likely need to initially consult the instructions for settings that require you to select multiple options. For example, to start the bake cycle you need to select bake, press the temperature button to set the temperature, press the timer button to set the time, press convection if you want to use that option and press start. It's something I'm sure will come naturally after using the oven a few times. It beeps once when it reaches the preheat temperature and opening the door to put the food in the oven initiates the timer countdown. When the amount of time you've specified has elapsed, the oven beeps five times and shuts itself off. All in all, a very convenient way to bake. The display lights up for a minute or two when you adjust any settings and when you open the door, and then goes dark again. There's a clock on the display although it can be a little hard to read when they display as dark. The first time I baked something, I thought I had done something incorrectly as the oven heated to the preheat temperature more quickly than I thought was possible. Click link in description for more reviews. Please subscribe today.